Hello friends. We will tell you about how to connect a SATA DVD writer from your computer. First, you know that SATA and ID connector is different. The difference is in SATA connector, in ID connector, you will see 39 pins both of sides. One will connect from DVD writer and one will connect from your motherboard. You can see this. And the difference in SATA connector is it's small in size. It's small here. Yeah. And in DVD writer, you can also see it here. It's also small. You have to connect this SATA connector like this. This is the point. This is connected. You have connected one point from here, and the second point is you have to connect from your motherboard. There are many connect connector options. One, two, three, four, four connectors. You have to connect it here. Here, like this you can check this this is called SATA connector and this one this one is called ID connector they are two options in this motherboard and there is one more pin in your DVD writer this this is power connector option you have to connect from your SNPS there is one cable left. This is SATA. And another one, this is ID. You have to connect your SATA connector from your generator. It's easy to connect just like this. You can remove it. Select and you can connect it here. Yes, like this. So it will work now. And one more thing, you have to do all these things after shut down and after unplug your computer. First you have to unplug your PC, computer, CPU, then you can connect your user writer. Thanks a lot. Please share hub-pages.com and you can also subscribe for more videos.